Shooting at long ranges is never easy. It takes dedicated practice and a basic understanding of the forces that affect the flight of a bullet. This short video will show you why the Leica Geovid HDB makes long range shooting a lot easier. The key success factors for long range shooting are practice and a strong knowledge of your equipment and surroundings. When it comes to equipment, every combination of caliber, bullet, and rifle will have different ballistic behaviors. A ballistic curve is always the result of the muzzle velocity of the projectile, the force of gravity pulling the projectile down, and the drag the projectile encounters while in flight. The first parameter is probably the simplest, muzzle velocity. Muzzle velocity is simply the speed the bullet has the moment it leaves the barrel. A faster velocity equates to a flatter curve. The second force that affects your ballistic curve is gravity. In space, where there is almost no gravity, a bullet would fly perfectly flat forever. Being on Earth, however, we face the strong effect of gravity, which pulls our bullet towards the center of the Earth at 9.81 meters per second squared. This means that a projectile's falling velocity changes with time. The longer it's in the air, the faster it falls. The third force that affects ballistics is drag. Drag is simply the air resistance the projectile encounters while in flight. There are a couple of components, the first being the shape of the projectile. A measure of each projectile's ability to overcome air resistance is called its ballistic coefficient. The higher the BC value, the flatter the trajectory. This figure has a dramatic impact on where your bullet hits. The second part of drag is air density. Air density refers to the mass of the air and is typically quantified in kilograms per cubic meter. As the density of air goes up, you'll encounter more drag on your bullet and effectively encounter more bullet drop. Air density fluctuates based on air temperature, elevation, air pressure, and humidity, all variables you are likely to encounter when hunting in the mountains. Another variable hunters typically encounter in the mountains is the strong possibility of shooting at steep angles. When shooting on flat ground, gravity drags the projectile perpendicular to its flight direction. However, when shooting at inclines or declines, this is no longer the case. Ranging for line of sight distance instead of horizontal distance results in a point of impact that hits high. When you start to think about all of the parameters that affect ballistics and all the possible combinations of those parameters and variables, it's easy to get overwhelmed. It's for precisely this reason why Leica developed the Geovid HDB, to keep you focused on making a good shot and not having to make calculations in the field.